Welcome back to 2230, your source for in-depth analysis and commentary on global affairs. Today, we delve into Singapore's recent diplomatic engagements in the Middle East, particularly concerning the humanitarian situation in Gaza. Foreign Minister Vivian Balakrishnan's visit to Israel, followed by meetings with Palestinian leaders, underscores Singapore's commitment to peace and stability in the region. Let's break down the key highlights of Dr. Balakrishnan's diplomatic mission. Expressing concern for Gaza's humanitarian situation, Dr. Balakrishnan's meetings with Israeli leaders, including President Isaac Herzog and Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu, were marked by Singapore's heartfelt concern for the dire humanitarian conditions in Gaza. This compassionate approach reflects Singapore's commitment to alleviating suffering and promoting humanitarian aid where it's needed most. Advocating for a ceasefire, amid escalating tensions, Dr. Balakrishnan called for an immediate humanitarian ceasefire to facilitate the swift and unhindered delivery of aid to Gaza. This stance emphasizes Singapore's belief in diplomacy and dialogue as essential tools for resolving conflicts and preventing further escalation of violence. Critique of military action, Singapore's foreign minister did not shy away from expressing his view that Israel's military actions in Gaza had gone too far. This balanced critique acknowledges the complexity of the situation while reaffirming Singapore's commitment to upholding international humanitarian law and principles. Condemning terrorism, Dr. Balakrishnan unequivocally condemned the terrorist attacks carried out by Hamas, demonstrating Singapore's steadfast stance against terrorism in all its forms. The call for the safe release of civilian hostages reflects Singapore's unwavering commitment to protecting innocent lives and promoting peace and security. Support for two-state solution, Singapore reiterated its support for a negotiated two-state solution, aligning with United Nations Security Council resolutions. This diplomatic position underscores Singapore's belief in the importance of dialogue and negotiation in achieving a lasting and just resolution to the Israeli-Palestinian conflict. As we reflect on Singapore's diplomatic efforts in the Middle East, it's crucial to recognize the significance of dialogue, empathy, and principled diplomacy in advancing peace and stability in the region. Let's continue the conversation in the comments below. Do you agree with Singapore's approach to the Gaza crisis? What other steps do you think can be taken to promote peace in the Middle East? Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to 2230 for more insightful content on global affairs. Until next time, stay informed and stay engaged.